Hi, my name is Marcela Valladolid and I'm here to talk to you about my new book, Fresh Mexico, 100 Simple Recipes for True Mexican Flavor. Now I'm going to prepare for you one of my favorite recipes in the book, it's an appetizer. It's a delicious seared queso fresco with fresh tomatillo salsa and tortilla chips. Very easy to prepare. All we're going to do is we're going to find some panela cheese. If you don't have panela cheese, just use mozzarella, a moist mozzarella great substitution. Now here we already started frying half of the cheese. As you can see it doesn't fall apart. It's going to give just for a great great crust on the outside nice and melty and warm on the inside. While that's frying up just a little bit of oil in the pan, medium high heat. We're going to let that sear for a little bit. We're going to prepare a tomatillo salsa. Actually half of it is already made. All we did is we took tomatillos which is this little thing right here. Take the husk off and boil these for about eight minutes. After you boil them, this is what happens. They kind of fall apart and they turn this green olive color. This is exactly what you're cooking for. I've added about a quarter of a cup of the cooking liquid, which is going to be the base for our salsa. Now to this, you're going to add half of a chopped onion, just in the blender. And after you add the onion, we're going to add the spice to our salsa. Here we have serrano chiles and garlic cloves. Now, the spice is hiding actually in the vein of the chile, not so much in the seed. So if you want a, less, a dish that's less spicy, just either add less chiles or remove all the vein from the chile. So we add it to the blender, just like this. It's a very simple recipe. And then we just add a little bit of chopped fresh cilantro, maybe a couple of tablespoons, just enough to give it a nice, bright, fresh flavor. And then we're going to blend this. We're going to blend it for a little bit. So after you blend it, you're going to let it cool down for a little bit, season with salt and pepper, and this is exactly what you get right here. Now this piece of cheese has been cooking, we're going to flip it on the other side. Ah, this is nice and brown and absolutely perfect. Let me turn up the heat a little bit. And once that's nice and seared, there we go, a nice high flame to get it all nice and crusty on the outside, like I said, oozy and warm on the inside. Can you hear that? It's perfect. So after we sear it on the other side, very carefully transfer it to a platter. Perfect. And then we're just going to spoon some of that salsa over, that fresh tomatillo salsa. See how easy it is to make a fresh salsa at home. Pour it over the top. Sprinkle with a little bit of chopped fresh cilantro. Absolutely beautiful. Now, for the tortilla chips, or totopos as we call them in Mexico, you can actually purchase these, as you know, in every supermarket, or what I do is I try to make them at home. You can cut up a tortilla into any shape you want. Usually triangles are going to give you less waste, so I always go with triangles. And you can either throw these on the grill pan until they get nice and dry, or you can fry them, as I did here, 350 degree oil until they get nice and toasty, and sprinkle them with salt while they're still warm so they absorb all that salt flavor. All we do, see my mouth is watering already. We put some of the tortilla chips on the plate. And this makes for a great, great appetizer when your friends are coming over or when you're having a party. So you're going to find recipes like these, very easy to prepare, very authentic all throughout the book. Fresh Mexico, 100 simple recipes for true Mexican flavor. I really hope you enjoyed the book. Hasta la próxima. Ciao.